For our next lesson, I want us to start off thinking about our essential question for our story. What is special about animals that live in the ocean? So I want you to think of some of the things that from jellyfish that might make them special or some other ocean animals. So ocean animals are special because, and then push play when you're ready to move on. Go ahead and do a check pause play where you push pause and then push play when you're ready with your answer. Okay, so our brain stretch is what words rhyme with bees. So go ahead and do a check pause play here and think of some words that rhyme with bees. And then when you have some ideas, go ahead and push play and see if you get any. Okay, so some of the things you might have came up with might be tease or sneeze, fleas, cheese, knees, these, peas, breeze. So see if you could write a short rhyming poem about bees. So something like the bees like to tease the fleas when they sneeze on their cheese or just something silly, a silly little rhyme. Um, have fun with that and then push play when you're ready to, to go to the next slide. All right, so say the word can, now add t to the sound to the end. What is the new word? Check, pause, play. Can't. Say the word let's, now take away the s sound. What is the new word? Check, pause, play. Let's. So we're going to add to the end of we and then we will have check pause play weave take away s from the end of its check pause play it add l to the end of we check pause play wheel take away m from the end of I'm. Check, pause, play. I. Add to the end of she. Check, pause, play. She's. Take away l from the end of they'll. Check, pause, play. They. Okay, so here's some everyday words for us to practice we're going to practice saying it spelling it and then I want you to write it but we'll go ahead and just say it and spell it and then you can push pause and then write your words down and then you can move on okay so say it say and spell with me first say because b-e-c-a-u-s-e -E. so you should be saying it with me better b-e-t-t-e-r better Go, G-O, go. Me, M-E, me. Old, O-L-D, old. Really, R-E-A-L-L-Y, really. Right, R-I-G-H-T, right. They, T-H-E-Y, they. Was, W A S, was. You, Y O U, you. So go ahead and say all these everyday words in a buzzy voice, like a B. Whatever you think that would sound like, go ahead and say it like that. When you're done, go ahead and push play and you can go to the next slide. Word mastery. So these are vocabulary words. Millions of fish live in the ocean. Name something else of which there are millions. What else has millions? Do a check pause play. Mom gave Henry two choices for dinner, for dessert. What's something you've had choices for this last week? So what's something that you got to choose? Do a check pause play. A tiny feather can drift a long way to a, on a breeze. 
Name other things that can drift on a breeze. A breeze is like wind. Check, pause, play. Mom said that it would be simple to make a salad for lunch. What? Lunch is simple for you to make. Check, pause, play. The sharks hunted for weaker fish to eat. Why does why does a shark hunt for weather fish or weaker fish? Why does a shark hunt for weaker fish? Check, pause, play. Tyler carefully wrapped the gift for his mom. Why are gifts wrapped? Check, pause, play. The spoiled milk smelled disgusting. Name a food you think looks, tastes, or smells disgusting. Check, pause, play. Callie can't decide if she wants to write about sharks or whales. What do you do to decide or on a writing topic? What do you do? Check, pause, play. Okay, so we're going to do our word study next. So let's build contractions. So we've been doing contractions this week with spelling. Watch how we build a contraction. I am becomes I'm. So I like to say that uh, when we do this, that I, A, and am are walking in a line. They're going to gym and they're following I because I is the line leader. But A wasn't paying attention. So when they were walking, the A bumped into the I and fell out. And now they have to put a Band-Aid there. So the, wherever the missing letter is is where the Band-Aid goes. But this is actually called an apostrophe. So I am becomes I'm. So let's look at he is. He's. Is not. Isn't. You can see that the O is the one that dropped out. You have. Try to guess what's going to drop out. You've. It is. It's. Do not. Don't. I have. I've. Okay, so you did some good work. I want you to practice reading I'm, he's, isn't, you've, it's, don't, and I've. Practice reading those until it's really quick, and then you're done for today with this lesson. Thank you.